Hi, you guys, and happy Sunday. This is Prophetess Ophelia Sabrina Acapo and wanted to bring you a prophetic word that the Holy Spirit spoke into my spirit on today. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. And the title of this prophetic word is Open Door Policy. Open Door Policy. And the first scripture is going to be Revelations 3 and 8. I know your deeds. See, I have set before you an open door, which no one is able to shut. For you have a little power and have kept my word and have not renounced or denied my name. And Holy Spirit, right now, I call you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. Speak through me. I decrease as you increase. I join my spirit in with the Holy Spirit. I place my hands in your hands and I submit my will totally back to your will. Ask you to intervene and let your will be done. Let me bring forth this word with your grace, with your glory, and with your power. So your name can be glorified. I decree and I declare that it is my portion in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus Christ's name, these blessings I'm asking and that I do pray. Amen, 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 and amen. So you guys, open door policy. So you guys, open doors came to me in prayer on yesterday. But you know me, guys. I have to have confirmation before I even bring a word forth. And then, today, I ran across it with a TV ad. And I definitely knew once it was confirmed that the Lord wanted me to bring it forth on today. The Lord is saying he has made provisions for you and you have his undivided attention anytime. Holy Spirit is saying that he is readily accessible and he is available for you 24 hours a day, seven days a week. The door never closes and whatever you need, he is faithful to perform it. He is the supplier of all of your needs and your source of supplier, your provider. Philippians 4 and 19. But my God shall supply all your needs according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. The Holy Spirit wants you to know that there are no limits nor restrictions on access, you can call him up anytime to tell him what you want. And I hear him saying, make your request known unto him. The Lord is saying, because you relied on his name and you did not deny him, he has granted you access. The Lord is wanting you to know that he is approachable and allowable and agreeable with his open door policy. Hebrews 11 and 6. But without faith, it is impossible to walk with God and please him. For whoever comes near to God must necessarily believe that God exists and that he rewards those who earnestly and diligently seek him. The Lord wants you to be confident and assured that you can put your total and complete trust in him and whatever it is, you can confide in him and you can trust that it will stay with him and he will never disappoint you. So anything you discuss or any problems you have, he is ready to resolve and solve them. Open door opportunities are available and nothing can stop or block it. This is your opportune time of destiny, promise, and purpose and the Lord's extended invitation 
to you and even a blank check policy. Isaiah 22 and 22. And I will place on his shoulder the keys of the house of David. He shall open and none shall shut. And he shall shut and none shall open. The Lord has given you the keys to the royal court of the highest position. The same way he did for David your ancestor. You have the keys to the kingdom of heaven through the Lord's open door policy and access. And the Holy Spirit is saying, now take your rightful place and walk into all of your open door promises of the Lord's yes and his amen. I pray that this word of open door policy has edified exhortated and exalted your life today in such a phenomenal way because I'm telling you, I can feel the anointing flowing in this word. I can feel the fire flowing in this word. I can see so clearly those doors open and I could see me walking through those doors and I tell you, I claim this word for myself. This open door policy right here is for Sabrina as well in the mighty name of Jesus. Grab a hold of the altar of this word because I'm telling you this word right here is speaking to some rhema words in this word right here. They are unbreakable. They are unstoppable. They are full force. And the Lord is saying, take it by force, all that belongs to you, because the doors are open. There's an open door policy. You can come to him 24-7. It does not matter. He's got you. You can call him up and tell him what you want specifically. Make your request known unto him. Thus saith the spirit of the living God. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And I pray that you had a fantastic Sunday by the special grace and mercy of God. I love each and every one of you guys. I'm constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word of open door policy has flowed, permeated, absorbed, and saturated in your spirit to let you know that don't put your trust in man. Put your trust in God because you can tell him anything specifically and he's going to see you through you can count on him to not deny you you can count on him to not let you down you can count on him when you make your request known to give you a yes and amen if you believe that you shall receive because the lord has an open door policy and it is agreeable thus saith the spirit of the living god like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And I will definitely be back with another one for you guys. On this evening, may the Lord richly bless each and every one of you. Keep the likes, the comments, the words of encouragement, the prayers. Thank you to all of you guys for subscribing to this channel. Thank you for even the ones who continuously keeps coming back. Thank you for the ones who continuously sow into this ministry. I appreciate, I appreciate you guys. I appreciate you guys. May the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys. Open door policy. Call the Lord up and tell him what you want specifically. Make your request known unto him because it is agreeable. He is approachable it is accessible to you thus said the spirit of the living god until the next one we will talk a little bit later god bless you take care bye-bye